Geneva is a sophisticated city that is surrounded by the beautiful Alps and sits on the shores of the sparkling Lake Geneva. As a center for diplomacy and high-end watchmaking, it's a fun mix of cultural diversity and city life. Geneva will take you on a magical journey of discovery, whether you want to look around its historic old town or eat some of the best food in the world. Be prepared to be amazed by its natural beauty, architectural gems, and friendly people. Under the Swiss sun, Lake Geneva is a beautiful gem that sparkles. With the beautiful, snow-covered Alps as a backdrop, it offers peace and beauty that can't be found anywhere else. You must take a boat ride across its calm waters and spend an afternoon relaxing on its shores. Lake Geneva is not just a body of water, it is the city's beating heart, with lots of water sports, beautiful promenades, and cozy cafes. It's a real treat for people who love nature and for photographers. The Jet Doe is one of Geneva's most famous landmarks. It is an amazing show that shoots water 140 meters into the air. It makes an interesting point of interest in the view of Lake Geneva from far away. From close up, the noise and mist of the fountain are exciting. The Jet Doe is not only a feat of engineering, but also a sign of Geneva's willingness to try new things. Make sure to take a picture of this beautiful scene at dusk when it looks great against the sky. The English Garden is a beautifully kept garden that is full of bright flowers and has quiet spots and great views of Lake Geneva. The most interesting thing is the colorful flower clock, which is a floral clock that shows how important timekeeping is to Geneva. The Cathedral de Saint-Pierre is a beautiful reminder of the long history of Geneva. The Cathedral is a beautiful piece of Romanesque and Gothic architecture that towers over the city's old town. Explore its interesting archaeological site, which shows how Geneva has changed over time. When you get to the top of the tower, you can see a wide view of the city and beyond. Don't miss the chance to hear the beautiful sound of its old organ when it is played at concerts. The beautiful Parc de la Grange is right in the middle of Geneva. Its big lawns, beautiful rose gardens, and stunning views of the lake make it a peaceful place to stay. With its old manor house, century-old trees, and beautiful paths, Parc de Lagrange is a great place for a relaxing stroll or a quiet moment to think. Chi John Castle is a beautiful piece of medieval architecture. Its beautiful surroundings and well-kept rooms take visitors back in time. Explore its rooms that are set up like a maze, its underground vaults, and its beautiful courtyards. From the towers of the castle, you can see the peaceful lake and the mountains around it. Lord Byron's poetry made Chi John Castle famous, and it is a must-see for history fans and romantics alike. In Geneva, there is a paradise called the Botanic Garden. It is filled with all kinds of exotic plants from all over the world walk through themed gardens that have been carefully put together, greenhouses full of tropical plants, and a wildlife park with flamingos and deer. It's a peaceful, green place where you can learn and get away from city life. Don't miss the Alpine Garden, which has plants that are native to Switzerland. The Palace of Nations is a sign of Geneva's long history of being a diplomatic city. As the European headquarters of the United Nations, it is a place where decisions about the whole world are made. A guided tour gives you information about international diplomacy and gives you access to large meeting rooms. Don't miss the beautiful peacocks in Ariana Park and the view of Lake Geneva from the front of the building. The Museum of Art and History is a great place for people who are interested in art, culture and history. It has a wide range of things in its collection, from things from ancient civilizations to modern art. Masterpieces by Picasso, Van Gogh, and Monet are on display, as well as interesting artifacts from the Greek, Roman, and Egyptian cultures. Don't miss the Great Horology exhibit, which shows the history of watchmaking in Geneva. The museum, housed in a beautiful building, is a rich, immersive journey through time and culture. The Monument de la Reformacio is a big tribute to the people who led the Protestant Reformation. 
Its large statues and bas reliefs tell the story of a very important time in religious history. It is in the peaceful part des Bastions, a peaceful place in the middle of the city, home to the oldest game of giant chess. You can take a slow walk under the shade of trees that are hundreds of years old, or relax by the beautifully designed fountain. In Geneva, the world's watchmaking capital, you must go to the Patek Philippe Museum. This museum tells the story of timekeeping from the early 1600s to the present in a beautiful way. On the top floor, there is a beautiful collection of Patek Philippe timepieces that show how well made the brand is. From fancy pocket watches to complicated wristwatches, each piece shows how precise and luxurious the Swiss are. When you come here, you won't just learn about watches. You'll also learn about how time has changed over time. The International Red Cross and Red Crescent Museum is a strong example of how people have helped each other in the past. This museum tells visitors how important these organizations are in helping people after disasters and resolving conflicts around the world. Its interactive displays, personal stories, and immersive displays bring to life the sad stories of individuals. It's more than just a museum, it's an emotional journey that makes you think about the problems in the world and the people who work hard to make it better. It's a truly life-changing event that has an effect that lasts. The Ariana Museum in Geneva is a ceramics and glass art gem that not many people know about. Its large collection spans seven centuries and three continents and is housed in a beautiful building. Each piece, from fine porcelain to colorful stained glass, tells a fascinating story and shows a different technique. The hall and spiral staircase of the museum are both beautiful examples of architecture. The museum is in a beautiful park and has great views of Lake Geneva and the mountains around it. Geneva's food scene is as international as the city itself. It is a gastronomic paradise where Swiss tradition and flavors from around the world come together. You can eat traditional Swiss dishes like fondue, raclette, and rusty in cozy gastropubs with wood walls, or you can try new dishes at Michelin-starred restaurants. Don't miss the chance to try Swiss chocolates and pastries in charming cafes from the old days. From lively farmer's markets with fresh food to food festivals that celebrate cuisine from around the world, Geneva has something to satisfy every taste. Chamonix is a charming alpine town, in the shadow of the beautiful Mont Blanc, that is just over an hour's drive from Geneva. As a place known around the world for skiing, climbing, and hiking, it has exciting outdoor activities going on all year long. From the Aguille du Midi cable car, you can see Mont Blanc, the highest mountain in the Alps, in a way that will blow your mind. The streets of Chamonix are full of life and are lined with cozy chalets, cafes, and top-notch restaurants. Chamonix and Mont Blanc are both great places to spend a day. Evian Le Bal is a lovely day trip from Geneva. It is on the French side of Lake Geneva. This beautiful town is known all over the world for its mineral water. Its Belle Epoque architecture, lush gardens, and peaceful lakeside promenade are great places to visit. Take a dip in the thermal spa to relax, try your luck at the casino, or take a slow boat ride on the lake. Visit the Evian Water Factory to find out where its famous water comes from. Evian Le Bal is a peaceful place to rest and relax surrounded by beautiful nature. Geneva is more than just a city, it's an experience that draws people in with its beautiful landscapes, long history, and busy way of life. Its people, who are friendly and open, show how international the city is, which adds to its charm. When the sun goes down, chic bars, live music venues, and upscale nightclubs light up the streets of Geneva and turn it into a lively metropolis. With its unique mix of nature and culture, Geneva makes you appreciate the finer things in life. It's a beautiful way to remember that time, like the jet dough, is constant, strong, and most of all, valuable. <laughs>